addendum. This I'm is my addendum. Sorry, so there's a Leo who's leaving the room right now because she just gave me what for watching the Leo saying it was dead boring. That one. So she was saying basically that it wasn't interesting as interesting as the Scorpio. So she's like, I said, well, what may, what would make it more interesting? Do you want me to like show more negative sides of the Leos? And she said, well, maybe it's just, it's not that interesting. And I'm like, okay, so how can I make it more interesting? And she's like, well, I don't know, but it's just, I know those things about me. So this is what I'm coming. This is what I did not want to say. And my friend, who's my dear, beloved friend, is on um, FaceTime with me right now, supporting me, uh, my Scorpio friend right now, which we won't say who it is. And so the truth, the truth of how I feel about Leos. I do love Leos. I do think they're warm and generous and kind and all of those things. And they can also be shallow as a freaking pond. So I get a little confused on how far I can go with talking about the Leos. Yes, they're bright, they're shiny. They they demand a lot because they want more attention than they deserve. There's your laughing. And they want to be clearly the best. And if they're going to be the best, they want you to, to entertain in a way that will show how fascinating and brilliant they are. So that's what I'm doing right now. I am redoing a little bit so you can see how fascinating and how important and how brilliant they really are. Like a little pond that goes this far. Just a little splash. That's it. So that's it. There you go. You happy? Now all the other Leos in the world are going to hate me. I apologize. If you see something about yourself that's helpful in that, great. If you don't, please take all of your comments to Renee L. Carson. She would be happy to deal with your discontent. Okay. Mwah. Bye.